small village near Kolhapur. Since last year, we all are facing life-threatening pandemic COVID situation. From last year, we as a doctor along with our staff continuously working for this situation. We are giving not only medicines but also mental support to our each and every patient. Rather than medicine, it is very important to give such type of mental support. I think most of the bad situations occurred due to fear of a COVID, fear about COVID. All people take care of their body, of their health. But what about mind? To make a strong and healthy mind, we have to do meditation every day and for physical health, yoga. These two things definitely help us to avoid COVID-like situation. We as humans have seen different phases, but I believe the coronavirus pandemic is the toughest of all. In this pandemic, when the world is in a lockdown, the corona warriors have stepped forward to serve mankind. They are in the form of doctors, nurses, police teams, police administrators. We can't match their efforts, but let us make an effort to express gratitude to Mention thanks to these selfless, stoic, super being Corona warriors. A big thank you. Namaste, Namaste everyone. Everybody. Thanksgiving is the greatest <coughs> form of gratitude. But thank you is a small words to the express for gratitude towards Corona warriors. Amid COVID-19 pandemic, not only doctors, nurses, ward boys, but also our delivery person, ration shop owners, vegetable, fruit vendors, farmers, teachers, Researcher, sanitation worker, grocery worker, emergency service provider, etc., who have been constantly playing crucial role by providing timely access to the necessary items and constantly assisting in fight against coronavirus. Today we want to thank you from the bottom of our heart for saving us for our crucial help for working tirelessly. We highly appreciate your words. Thank, thank you. you. Corona. No duty is more urgent than return the thanks. It is my duty to thank all the unsung heroes of COVID-19 pandemic. It may be a doctor, nurses, police, delivery boys, shopkeepers, food sellers, everybody who helped me and my family in this pandemic. I hope this pandemic will end soon. But the efforts that are taken by these all the unsung heroes will be remembered forever. I, Principal Vivigiri, hereby thank everyone who is working continuously for the benefit of me and my family. Thank you. Good morning, everybody. Um, I take this opportunity to thank all those people who have been toiling hard in this uh, pandemic situation, the frontline workers especially, like the doctors, nursing staff, the sanitary staff, the grade four people, maybe the drivers, you know, the cleaners, and all those who are directly or indirectly involved in this, they have really done a very commendable job. And you know, we should salute them. And as uh, aware citizens, we must take care that we follow all the COVID norms because the battle is not over yet. But definitely, we are about to win, and the day is not far as long as we keep ourselves safe and take precautions. Take care, be safe. The world saw an unprecedented enemy all of a sudden who stuck unawares and during this crucial time we must be grateful to the great corona warriors who rose to the occasion the doctors the police the sanitizer workers each and every one they came together without caring for their own personal things they stood by our side day and night and today I can confidently say that we are able to contain this coronavirus and definitely we'll be able to overcome this crucial disease in some time. Thank you so much all the corona warriors. Good morning everybody. I thank all the people, those they are the frontline workers, particularly doctors, teachers and uh, housekeeping uh, persons the caterers, those they are working so hard day and night for getting their safety and security and got affected by the corona and got over uh, the corona and uh, still 
daily providing their services for the betterment of the society. Though we lost the life of many doctors and uh, many uh, known and uh, uh, you know unknown people also have lost their lives, but uh, there are uh, lot of efforts have been put in by the uh, frontline workers to save the life of thousands of people. So my salute to all of them and prayer to everyone that uh, if everybody would uh, take the right precautions and follow the guidelines, we would definitely uh, become victorious against Corona. Thank you everybody and God bless you.